In this video, we have an equation with a rational exponent. So the question is x to the 3 halves equals 64. So you can do this in one step, um, but I, I usually like to do it in two. That way I don't have to memorize any formulas. So typically what I always do is I try to get rid of the number here on the bottom first. So to get rid of that number, what you do is you have to square both sides. Watch. So you do this thing here, and it's squared. And that's equal to 64 squared. Okay, and the reason is what happens now is you multiply this, right? You do 3 halves times 2, and then the 2's cancel, and so you get 3. So here you get x cubed equals 64 squared. So for example, if you had x to the 7 thirds, then you would cube both sides, and then the 3's would, would cancel. You can do this with or without a calculator. Um, Let's do, it, let's do it without. So we have x cubed equals 64 squared. So to get rid of the uh, 3, we can take the cube root of both sides. So we get x equals the cube root of 64 squared. So how do you do this without a calculator? Well, you can write this as 64, and it's 2 over 3. Always. You can always do that, OK? Always. So if you have, if you have this, right? It's, it's n over m, always, always, every single time, n over m. So now what you can do is you can put the 3 here, put the 64 here, and you can, it doesn't matter where you put the 2. So you can put the 2 on the outside or the inside, it doesn't matter. And the cube root of 64 is 4. And so you get 4 squared, which is, which is 16. So that was uh, a, lot of, a lot of math there. An another way to do it is when you get here, x cubed equals 64 squared. You can just put it in your calculator, right? 64 squared, trying it now, is 4,096. Okay. Then when you take the cube root to get rid of the 3, you get x equals cube root of 4,096. So if your calculator doesn't have a cube root key, what you can do is you can raise it to the, there's a 1 here, so it's 1 over 3. You can raise it to the 1 power, and that will give you 16. I hope that made sense.